welcome back to my channel. Today I figured I would give you a updated tack room tour. Since my last tack room tour, which I think was a couple years ago, I've since moved barns and moved states. <laughs> so I figured now would be a good time to do a updated tack room tour. With that being said, the horses are finishing up their two week quarantine. They've been here almost two weeks now, I think. Yeah, I think we only got like five days to go since they class for them to finish up their quarantine and then we can go ahead and mix them in with the new horses um but yeah i figured that would or since moving and because it's been a hot minute since i have uploaded anything i will give you guys a fresh look at my new tack room setup so without further ado let's get into today's video so, uh, when you walk into the barn here, this is all the tack lockers, uh, that little capacity tote there that is also mine. I will show that later, but my tack locker is all the way down here, lockers I should say, and those two there. Um, outside my lockers, I have these two halters, one for each horse, just kind of chilling out. This is the halters that they were shipped down in, and I like them readily available. Behind that you will see my lunge whip. So I get these lockers opened. So this first locker here is the one that I use for Star, just because it's got my western saddle and it's easier to get that out of a higher up locker than it is a down below. So as we come in here, we've got her everyday bridle, split reins, an extra bit, nose band, a lunging cabosom. Uh, this is the breakaways that was on their halters. I just wanted them locked up. Over here is the breast collar. Let me move that out of the way. And back here we have her rope halter and lead. And then this is her scoop boots in this bag. Back here we have a bucket with her. It would be used as her water bucket, but as you can see, I've got some other things in there. So it's kind of just turning into a catch-all currently. Um, and then right here I've got my saddle pad, and then my saddle, my saddle sack, and the leopard serape. Same with my nylon, uh, platigo. I've got a soft brush here, along with the box of treats. Mind you, this is still packed as if I were moving because I'm still trying to get settled in here myself. And then here is my helmet bag with my purple helmet. This is what I use for my everyday riding. And then this over here is a sign that my friend made for me back when we were both in college. So that is a maybe year, year and a half year old Callie and a seven, eight year old star. Uh, the locks that I use to lock said lockers along with my keys for my car. So we come down here, we've got another bucket this one I can easily access. So it's got Callie's grazing muzzle, a reflective vest, my lunge line, and my stirrup covers, my English saddle. Said English saddle with saddle pad, girth, the black bridle bag back here. Oh gosh has my leather halters in there. This purple one here has miscellaneous tack. Underneath that is my medical kit. 
and then a spare thing of boots in case I come straight from work and I don't have a pair of boots. I still have a pair of boots. And then over here is my old set of barrel reins that I've turned into a neck rope so I can work on bridleless riding in the winter months. I've got my English breastplate, which is just rolled simply rolled leather. I've got Callie's rope halter. Here I've got Kelly's bridle with a boucher, because that's how I've pronounced it. And then we've got her western training bridle with just a simple loose ring snaffle. And some trail reins, so they're leather on the ends here that clip to the bit. And then cotton in which that go in my hands. Underneath here is a little trash can. So I've got a place to throw away my garbage. Now that those are locked up, we'll turn around and we'll go this way. So then over here we've got a spot to tie two horses. We've also got some hay storage here currently right now. And then right here, for the sake of the video, <laughs> I stuck my sir single out of my tack trunk. So we've got my sir single with attached side reins. I've got a cooler, extra western girth, some crops, my grooming, uh, my show grooming kit, my back on track sheet, and I believe um, along with this rope, I've got a couple extra English saddle pads down in here. Yep, I got three extras. Four extras. Four extra saddle pads. That just latches just like that. And yeah. Alright. Alright, and that is my tack room tour. And currently what I have. If I update, I will try and remember to record and update you guys as I update my tech area. So I will see you guys in my next video.